If you like our video, click the button to subscribe to our channel and get easy access to new content. To see our full suite of ad-free video courses, instruction manuals, and quick reference guides, visit us at www.teachucomp.com. You can create a personal document template in Word that you store on your computer for documents you frequently create and only need to change slightly between copies. For example, if you had to send a boilerplate response letter to customers for product inquiries, you could create the document and indicate where to place the customized information in the letter. You can then save the document as a personal document template, from which you can create quick copies in the future to which you only need to send the customized response. However, before you create personal templates in Word, double-check Word's default personal templates location in its Save options. This is the folder location within which Word saves your personal templates and within which it looks for personal templates by default. If you don't specify a personal templates location, then the Microsoft 365 apps like Word create a new folder called Custom Office Templates within your user-specific documents folder for this purpose when you later save a new template. So, if you upgraded to Microsoft 365 from a previous version and have existing templates to use, you can either copy the existing templates to the new folder location after saving a new template, or you can manually specify the previous template folder location in all your Microsoft 365 apps to ensure the apps know where to look for previous personal templates you created and also where to save future ones. If desired, to set the older default personal templates folder location in Word as the new default personal templates location after upgrading your Microsoft 365 installation. Type percent app data percent backslash Microsoft backslash templates into the search bar in the taskbar if using Windows 11 or Windows 10. Then press the Enter key on your keyboard. Windows then opens the previous default save location for templates in a File Explorer window. Click into the address bar in this window to select the folder address. Right-click it, and then choose the Copy command from the pop-up menu that appears to copy it. Next, open Word and click the File tab in the ribbon. Then, click the Options command at the left side of the Backstage view to open the Word Options dialog box. Then, click the Save option at the left side of the Word Options dialog box. Right-click into the Default Personal Templates Location field that appears to the right at the bottom of the Save Documents section. Then select the Paste command from the pop-up menu that appears to paste the folder location you copied from the address bar of the File Explorer window earlier. Then click the OK button at the bottom of the Word Options dialog box to set the new location. You can also repeat this for other Microsoft 365 applications like Excel and PowerPoint if needed. To then create a personal template in Word, create a document that you want to save as a template and make sure to indicate where to place the customized information in the document. Then click the File tab in the ribbon. Then click the Save As command at the left side of the Backstage view. Then click the This PC command to the right. Then click the Browse button below that to open the Save As dialog box. In the Save As dialog box, type a name for the template into the File Name field. Then use the Save As Type dropdown to select Word Template. Word then changes the default folder into which it saves the template to match the folder you entered as the default Personal Templates location in the Word Options dialog box, or it creates a new folder called Custom Office Templates within your user-specific documents folder if you didn't specify a default personal templates location. To more easily access this template in the future, do not change this folder save location.
Next, click the Save button in the Save As dialog box to save the template into the folder. You can then close the opened template document. To later create a new copy of that document from the template in Word, click the File tab in the ribbon. Then click the New command at the left side of the Backstage view. Then click the new Personal Template category that appears above the suggested searches and to the right of the term Office to view your personal templates in the list below. Then click the name of the desired personal template to create a new copy of a document from that template, which you can then edit as needed. Remember to click the subscribe button to see more of our videos. See our full suite of courses, instruction manuals, and quick reference guides at www.teachucomp.com.